Hello YouTube, this is Hirzi Japan Boy here and this is the review of the SH3 Guards Kamen Rider Mito Storm from the Kamen Rider Forza series. This is the upgrade or the power form for Kamen Rider Meteor. So a little bit about where I got this uh, figure. I got this figure uh, locally here in Singapore for about $42. So uh, let's put the figure aside and let's take a look at the packaging. Uh, so we have the Meteor Storm here, Kamen Rider Meteor Storm, uh, for the Kamen Rider Forza logo, uh, Tamashii Nation's logo Bandai's logo, uh, SH Figures Kamen Rider Meteor Storm, and um, some planets around here. And the sides of the packaging we have SH Figures Kamen Rider Meteor Storm, as well as the top, and the sides, and the bottom we have some other stuff as well. And uh, at the back of the packaging, we have some poses of uh, Kamen Rider Meteor Storm. And his main weapon is the Meteor Storm shaft and his other accessories he comes with. Now let's bring back the figure in. So this is the Kamen Rider Meteor Storm. Uh, so we have the uh, a nice blue, metallic blue color plus uh, yellowish gold. Him plus the red eyes on the visor area. Uh, now for the uh, articulation of the figure, we have the neck. Swivel the neck, the head. You can uh, rotate it. You can ah uh, yes, you can turn this 360 degrees. And the arms, you can just straighten it up. Um, and then the uh, elbow. There's two elbow joints here. One here and here. And uh, rotation of the wrist, swivel of the waist. You can turn uh, 360 degrees as well. And the leg area, you can put it up. And the knee joint, yes, two knee joints here, double knee joint. And the rotation of the ankle here, and the toe, you can flip it up as well. That goes same for the uh, other as well and before I move on to the accessories I'm gonna show you the belt and his uh, Meteor Galaxy so let's uh, first off look, take a look at the Meteor driver so this is the Meteor driver you, uh, you can spin this area here you can all, what you can do is just uh, remove the um, switch here Meteor Storm switch to be inserted to the uh, Meteor Storm shaft and this, this piece is uh, quite loose you can easily drop this uh, driver off and this thing as well quite uh, loose so uh, the Meteor Galaxy this is the Meteor Galaxy it comes with another piece where um, the Meteor switch will be inserted here it's already molded inside here. I will show it in a while. So now quickly uh, show the hands. So these are the hands uh, for for touching the pad here, this area here. And only it's only for the uh, left hand. And now we have the, next. Sorry, next we have the um, these hands to hold the. Uh, rip cord for the uh, meteor storm shaft just like this next we have the hands uh, to grab on to the meteor storm shaft and I will show you that in a while and then the um, these hands um, some some kinds of some uh, it's like a spider-man hands Next, um, it will be these thumbs up and uh, thumbs down hands, just like Kuga. And next, lastly, we have the uh, relax hands. Uh, it comes with a food, uh, food droid called um, Softonia, if I'm not wrong. Uh, so you have the food form and the um, robot form, I guess, or droid form. Whatever you call it. Alright. So um it comes with another two 
uh, Meteor Storm Switch, one with the record and one with no record. And then, uh, so this is another this is another piece of the uh, Meteor Galaxy where the uh, Meteor Switch is inserted here. So you can see, let's take this piece off. So you can see that one there's one with uh, no switch and one with a switch. Alright, let's put it back. Okay, now the Meteor Storm shaft. We have the not extended version and the extended version. You can just take this piece off and just attach to this piece. Yeah. There you go. So um, let's take a look at him um, holding the Meteor Storm Shaft. Okay, so uh, this is how uh, he looks like with the shaft. So um, here is where you can insert the Meteor uh, Storm Switch. So you can just take out, never mind, from the belt, and then uh, you can just uh, insert it in here. Correct. Okay, there you go. That's how you insert the uh, switch here. And we put on the bell and it drops off again. So that is one of the problems I have with the figure of this dropping off and with the horns here, I don't know if you should call it the horn, uh, it somehow uh, got chopped off and in, yeah that's all with the problems I have with the figure. Um, so with that um, I end my review here, so like, subscribe and comment. See ya.